Queen's Laces and welcome to my channel. If you're new here, I'm an online reseller on sites like eBay and Poshmark. And today I have a gigantic Atlanta thrift haul. Um, I went to two different locations. Um, I do have a huge palette that I'm still trying to get through, but I was just so tired of seeing uh, the same brands over and over again. So I thought it was time for me to get out and put some more quality items um, back into my eBay store and Poshmark closet. So um, I don't know how much I spent or anything like that. Um, so when you're watching, just keep in mind that most items are uh, like tops usually are $5.99 and pants are $5.99. Um, dresses are $6.99. Um, so yeah, some of them were half off, some of them weren't, so I'm just going to go ahead and jump right into it. I have three piles, so, um, I'm going to start with the items that are already listed. Starting with these Beta Brand size small, they're like the yoga career pants. Or like yoga dress pants. And they're like a boot cut. Um, and these are a pair of rag and bone, size 27. They're the zipper crop. And like this really cool light wash, like acid wash style. And then these are AG maternity jeans. I pick up maternity jeans if they are a good brand, like the DL 1961s. Um, I just picked up, um, it might have been from Atlanta. I think it was from Atlanta. Um, the, yes, they were. The maternity um, DL 1961, like Aaron jeans, those sold already um, for $35. These are just white like, um, what is it called? Like cigarette leg maternity jeans. And then this is my favorite brand right now to pick up, um, Spanx. Like I sell these like crazy when I find them. Um, and really, really quickly. Uh, these are size small, like a gray almost colored pull on jegging. So they're like a denim material. And these are maternity again. They're AGs. They're kind of more like a legging material. It's Cupro, which if you don't know what that is, it's like a really soft um, material. And these ones um, are AGs again. I'm very picky with the AGs that I pick up. Um, I pick up the maternity ones because those do well for me, but I pick up the Stevie's, the Prima's, and the Farah's. And sometimes, if it's like a good style, sometimes the stilts, but not always. Uh, but these are the Stevie ankle, and they're size 26. And these are uh, Eileen Fisher, size large. I sell these all day. I mean, Eileen still sells consistently for me. It's like my bread and butter. These are, okay, these ones are super nice. And with the white jean season coming up, um, I picked them up. It's the Stilt Roll Up. Um, AG jeans and actually these ones just sold on eBay this morning for $30 so I'm happy about that and we put those aside so I can pack those up okay and then these ones are Spanx these are actually still on their website size small I bought some for myself <laughs> Uh, last summer, the crop style, and they were expensive, so I was really happy when I saw these ones. It's this, like, bluish uh, gray camo 
print legging. And then these are Athleta, size eight. I think I might have just sold these ones too. If I did, I'll pop up um, what they sold for. Um, but they're like a high rise nylon y kind of like like dress pant like you could wear these to the office they're really nice uh, this is current elliott size 25. they are um the rolled skinny in caution red and if you don't know current elliott always has their um style name on the interior tag here of what the item is but these are just some cute jeans <laughs> oh these were my favorite ones that I found because these sell so well um Spanx size medium the faux leather legging Uh, this is a, is this AG? Let me see. Yes, they're AG size 28. These are like a darker wash um, or medium wash, kind of a cropped maternity jean. This is another bread and butter that always sells for me. Um, it's Neon Buddha, size medium. This is like a Kalanick white tunic top this is scotch and soda size medium if you don't know what the tag looks like it's got like this little sewing machine on it um and this is just a striped basic tee and then this is another neon buddha size medium purple long sleeve tunic top and it's got this really cute detail right here on the sleeves that I liked this is rag and bone um, and it's a size medium just a basic heather gray short sleeve tee And then this is a Kimmy and Ken size large. I'm gonna put this aside. It's this linen crochet long sleeved tunic top or three quarter sleeve. Um, and it's anthropology and it's sold. So I'm gonna put that aside. That one sold for $20. That was a quick flip for me. And I'm gonna turn that light up because it's like bothering me. Okay, that's better. I'm sorry, like it was just shining right here above my head and it was distracting me. But um, I'm sorry if you can see the ring light anytime I sway back and forth. I need to come up with a better setup for filming these videos, but I just haven't had the time to do that yet. Um, this is Girls from Savoy, which is anthropology. And the reason why I picked it up, this is size four, is because of the print. Whenever I see animal print from anthropology, I pick it up because they always tend to do better for me than just like the regular pieces. I just thought this was so pretty. It's got birds and butterflies on it. It's corduroy, but it's really lightweight, so it can still be worn in the springtime. And then these are Max Mara. If I'm gonna give them 30 days, if they don't sell well, then I'm gonna send them into the Real Real because Max Mara does very well for me on the Real Real. It's just a pair of tan wool work trousers. And then this is, I got an offer for this this morning. Um, I haven't really responded yet. I need to go back and look at it. Um, but it's just this basic Lululemon gray tank. And then I also found a bluish purple, kind of. Like a deep purple, maybe. Tank top. And then this is Florite from Anthropology. This is a size extra, extra small key. Um, and the only reason, I usually wouldn't pick up that size, but I really liked this crushed velvet look. I thought it was just really pretty. I liked the style of it. It's 
So I went ahead and picked it up. I don't know how it's going to do, but we'll see. And then this one, I probably went to picked up. I was just in a hurry going through everything, checking things for stains. Um, so yeah, I just went ahead and threw it in the cart. It was $2.99. They counted all the tank tops as t-shirts, which was awesome. So they were uh, the $2.99 price instead of the $5.99 price. But it's just this Athleta tank with this like paisley lace uh, print on it. And this is a size small, basic workout top, probably get like 15 bucks for it. This shirt I have sold before, um, I believe on Poshmark. Um, it's just Maeve. This is size 8P. Really, really cute fox print. This is an Athleta, says extra small. It is the older tag, but I really liked the style of this, the asymmetric hem and the like zip up moto style almost jacket sweater or sweater jacket this one is rebecca taylor size eight and it's silk and wool and this one's also the older tag but um rebecca taylor seems to do pretty well for me um i loved the ruffles on the sleeves i just thought this was so pretty um so i went ahead and picked it up that would be a really pretty like office dress. This is Athleta, size small, just a little tank. This is Wilfred Free, size large. It's a heather gray long sleeved like crop top. And yeah, I have a whole, when I pulled my shirt on earlier, I like pulled it too hard here. So there's like a little hole, yeah. I ripped my shirt, but I didn't have time to change. So if you see me like lift up my arm and see the hole in my sleeve, that's why. Um, but this is, um, yeah, this is sold at Aritzia, I believe is um, where it's from. But that tends to do pretty well for me. Um, this is Free People, size small. And I picked up another one that was like identical to this a uh, couple uh, weeks ago and it already sold. So I went ahead and picked this one up too. I think it's called the Catalina. It's called the Catalina top. This one was half off. I went ahead and got it because of the pretty floral embroidery. It's just J. Crew collector tee line. And I just thought that was really cute. And it's a size medium. This one sold already. Eileen Fisher, it was just a little silk shell, tank, cami, whatever. Um, nothing special. It was size extra small too. So that sold on eBay for $18. Um, this is exciting for me. This is Kula Bar. I think that's how you say it. Size small, it's an SPF protective um, or UV ray protective sun shirt like you can wear it outdoors it's new with tags and it's like a polo style long sleeve shirt this is Rebecca Taylor size extra small this is a cashmere and silk blend uh, ruffled cardigan and this um, Lululemon tank was a little nicer than the others, but it was still $2.99, which is awesome. Um, it's a pink cutout, uh, crisscrossy, strappy back top. And I looked and looked for, oh wait, this one, this one had the tag on it already. It's a size eight. That one's cute. Um, and then this uh, Lululemon top I really like because it's got this tie detail on the back, which I thought was adorable. And it's kind of got this like open back there. It's this heather gray top. I just really love the style of this. And I have the size listed um, with those uh, tank tops that don't have the size like hidden away in them. I had to you know, measure them and included the size chart and everything in my listings. Um, this brand does really well for me. Um, it's a Wilt, size small. 
it doesn't sell for like crazy many, but it sells consistently. It's like the new James purse for me. Um, but this is just a long sleeved gray top. And then I found another one, which is a blue short sleeved top. And this one is a size medium. This blouse is currently on Revolve. It's Diane von Furstenberg. It's called the Harlow blouse and it's in this really cool um, animal print and it is silk. This brand I pick up if it's cashmere. This one is 100% cashmere. It's white plus Warren, extra small. It's this really beautiful lavender purple open front duster. It's not the season for it right now, but I still picked it up. This is a new tag, Holding Horses. It was originally $148. Even the clearance price on it was $90. It's a size two, and it's this um, button down, gray and white striped, collared, sleeveless midi dress. This is rag and bone, size medium, and it's this like um, linen blend blue wrap top. This is Eileen Fisher, and it's a size extra small, and it's this um, open front linen blend blazer. This is a brand I usually don't find, so I don't know if it's going to do well or not, but it's Title IX. This is a size large, and it's a mock neck, long sleeved midi dress, or no, this is a knee length dress, but still, I liked the um, button detail on the sleeves here, and the comps were pretty good for that. This is a brand that I haven't found before. I think they carry it, I don't know, Nordstrom, they carry it somewhere, <laughs> but this is a Foxy Docs size small. I just thought that this style was beautiful with the lace detail, the long sleeved dress. This one is Eliza J. It's new with tags. It's a size eight and it's this really pretty burgundy, drapey, sparkly dress. And I'm starting to get into Okay, I did a local Goodwill trip and I got like five things and they're blended in here with this. So I'm just gonna go ahead and show them. I'm not sure if I showed them in a previous video, but if I have, I haven't put them away yet in my inventory, so that's why. Um, this is Privacy Please, size extra small. I did get this one at my local Goodwill, I'm not in Atlanta, but it's this pretty wrap style um, ruffled romper. And then this is a plus size brand called City Chic, and it's a size extra small, which is actually a 14 with this brand. And it's this pretty teal color dress. I thought that was really pretty. And then this was a new with tag, Lucky Brand blouse. And I think, okay, now we're back into, okay, we're back into the Atlanta stuff. This is Joie, size extra small. It's like a tweed, frayed, hem, um, like sweater blazer almost. This one I'm going to keep for myself because I'm a Disney like fanatic, um, but it's just unique low, size extra large, Mickey sweatshirt in this dusty pink color. I really, really like that. And then this one was really interesting. Um, I love finding vintage dresses, but it's just 
they're so few and far between, so my eyes lit up when I saw this one, but it's um, Malia Honolulu. Some of these can do really, really well. I loved this heart print, though. It's pink and white heart print, and it's like a fit and flare style dress with this tie detail on the waist. And even the straps have this pretty crisscross detail, and I just loved it. It has a couple of little stain marks on it, but I noted that in the listing, and I think that it's going to do well. Uh, this one, what are you? Oh, this one had a flaw, so I took down that listing. Um, this is Bella Doll, size extra small, and it's like a heathered gray button-down sleeveless shirt dress. Okay, this is flax, size small, and it's a tan, like wide leg style pant. I love selling flax, it does very well. This is um, Fabletics, and I don't usually pick up their leggings, but I picked this up because I loved the ruched detail on the leg. I thought that was really, really nice. And then those are from other, I had those, these ones in my previous video, so I'm not going to show those. Um, but this is, I picked this one up, it's Sundry, or, uh, no, not Sundry, sorry, Super Dry Japan, and I thought that was pretty interesting, and I looked it up, and the comps are pretty good. Um, so I went ahead and paid $6.99 for it. It's a size extra large and it's just a really, really nice, like it's got this super dry with the Japanese writing right there. I just thought this was so cool. Such a cool jacket. So we're going to see how this does. This is... Everlane, just a simple Everlane extra small striped short sleeve tee. This is Diane von Furstenberg, size two, and it's this like creamy colored um, sheath dress. This is Rebecca Taylor, and I had the measure for the size. I believe it was a size two. Um, it's just like this iridescent almost pink strapless mini dress and then I got this Eileen Fisher size large royal blue tunic blouse and this is a brand that I've only found once before um but the comps are they're like not phenomenal but they're pretty good um it's torn by Ronnie Kobo, and it, this is a size medium, and this is pretty knit eyelet, um, like a mauve -y color. I thought that was pretty. This is Acri, <coughs> sorry, uh, Acri Punto, and this is a size six. It's this mustardy, chunky knit, uh, cardigan like a mini bolero style cardigan I wouldn't have picked this up unless it was like a higher end brand like that if it doesn't do well I'll send it into the real real this is spider which is like an outdoorsy sporty brand and I just thought that the detail was pretty cool because you zip it down and like there's a web and you can zip it back up and then it's just solid white there um, but yeah, I liked this one and it's a size medium. And then this is one September and it's a size small. I got this because I loved the like tribal boho print that it had on it. It's an open front like duster cardigan. And then I got this pair of Madewell size 31. They're called the Skinny Flare. 
and they're a high-waisted cropped uh, raw hen jeans. Okay, so that's everything that I have listed. I'm going to now start on all of the things that I have not listed yet. And actually, let me check. Um, so I think what I'm going to do, since this video is already pretty long and I still have a ton of stuff to get to, is I'm going to do two parts. Um, so that is everything that I have listed already. In the next video, I will show you the stuff that I haven't listed yet as of now. Hopefully by the time I film the video, I will have all of them listed. Um, so if you want to see part two of that, uh, make sure to subscribe to my channel and hit the bell notification icon so you'll be alerted when I upload that video. Um, and if you liked this video, please give it a thumbs up and follow me on Instagram at Queensley Thrifter. and I will see you next time. Bye.